Something is wrong. Nothing's wrong. Something's wrong, I can tell. Okay, I admit it. What is it? You must tell me. All right. Where do I start? Okay. When we first got married, I was so happy I can't even describe it. It was like walking on something transparent and extremely light. Go on. And for a while it was perfect, but then after a while, something inside me began to change. I tried to ignore it, hoping I would go back to how I was feeling at the start, but instead I just became more confused, until eventually I realized I could no longer keep running, and that it was time to face the truth. So what are you trying to tell me? What is it you want? I don't know. I feel like I don't know anything anymore. All I know is that I can't go on living like this any longer. I see. And are you sure about the way you are feeling now? After all, we have only been married for around 45 minutes. Yes. I must have gone over it in my head a thousand times. This is all my fault. It's no one's fault. Yes it is. It's my fault. Ever since we got married I've become increasingly difficult to be with, thinking only of myself and my own needs. I should have paid you more attention. Taken more of an interest in your work. What is it that you do again? I'm an investments analyst. That's right. And what were we just talking about? Me not knowing anything anymore. That's right. I remember now. But you are still hiding something. I can tell. I know you too well. There is someone else isn't there. Who is she? Ethel, please. It's the registrar, isn't it? I saw how she was looking at you during the ceremony. Okay. You are right. It was the registrar. I knew it. I knew it was the registrar. So what is her name, this registrar? Her name is not important. Though it is Hazel Etherington. And do you love her, this Hazel Etherington? You must tell me. It's not as simple as that. Oh God. I knew it. Yes. I'm afraid it's true. She is going to have my baby. This is all my fault. I told you already. It is no one's fault. Except possibly Hazel Etherington's. Oh Antonius I am so torn. I don't want you to leave me. We have been through so much together. Yes. However there is a possible solution. There is? And what is that? We adopt Hazel Etherington. Adopt Hazel Etherington? Yes. Think about it. You can have the daughter you have always wanted. And soon a grandchild too. While I can have you, and also Hazel Etherington. You are right. It is the solution to all our problems. We must do it. I will instruct my lawyers, to have the papers ready by the morning. You make me so happy Antonius. You make me very happy also. And soon we shall be a family.